things keep changing, they're not over yet, so I'm expecting it to be quicker. <laughs> The wrong question, there shouldn't be a referendum, we just had elections. To uh, Eva Kaili, it's very clear she should immediately step down. I think the damage that has now been done already is enough to say um, we shouldn't even have to remove her from her vice president position, but this should be done by her proactively. Um, I hope that she's going to very closely cooperate with the authorities so that we can really shed light to the things that has hap that have happened um, to the social democratic group in the European Parliament, but to all groups, um, we have to look closer at what is happening um, when there are votes like we had in the last plenary week on the Qatar resolution. I think questions have to be asked. Uh, the allegations against uh, former uh, Vice President Kylie is uh, has obviously come as a shock um, to a lot of people in the European Parliament. Um, such grave and massive uh, corruption um, is obviously not only an individual problem, but it really shakes the institution. Um, it is an issue that has to be dealt with uh, on the highest level and in the most urgent way now, um, because this is far beyond um, what has happened in this very specific case. This is really about um, the reputation of a democratic institution, the trust of our citizens. The speech of um, Eva Kaili, who defended Qatar um, very vigorously, um, and I think this will have to be clarified because obviously it's an absolutely inacceptable situation and that members of a parliament take money and then uh, consequently take certain political stances. Thank you all and thank you the rapporteurs for the work we achieved.